I'm currently standing in front of the Arum Orthodox Cultural Center that has been targeted yesterday by Israeli warplanes. This center was an area uh, that had gym, uh, cultural activities, and a lot of uh, 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 educational and cultural activities where uh, I know people who used to come to this area and uh, play uh, and use the gym, uh, uh, the gym hall here. Uh, it, the, this place also has a huge uh, a playground, as you see. But now it's full of the ro of rocks and rubbles. Uh, be beside me, on like on very close to here, is also the Room Orthodox Schools, and this is a school for Christians and Muslims. Just like this place, people from uh, Muslim and Christian people used to come here and used to. Uh, benefit from this area. Uh, we came here a couple of weeks ago in the beginning of this uh, uh, Israeli assault and we saw hundreds of people taking this place as a refuge and also I was talking to the people in the neighborhood and they told me that the, uh, the school also had people um, in there taking refuge and shelter but they uh, were asked to leave and they evacuated uh, the school. People fled from this area, they fled from the school. Other people received messages in this neighborhood. And as you see, Gaza is a very densely populated area where houses are sticking along, glued to each other. If this, if this place, like this place was targeted, all of the surrounded houses are also targeted. As you see, complete destruction. This area only had cultural activities. Um, the Israelis have been bombing uh, uh, vital places in the Gaza Strip, wedding halls, shops, markets. There has been a lot of different unjustified um, uh, uh, targets, to be honest. This is the playground. It, it had green grass and a lot of people used to come and play here.